gonna pat this out using my fingers don't judge my nails i know i need a fill but um i'm going to vegas next week <laughs> so it's like i'm not gonna get my nails done twice broke people things you know i'm gonna just wait um i kind of wanted this to be a talk through video but i kind of just might not talk the whole time because i don't really know what to talk about any blending brush um just blend out the edges so that you have a smooth canvas to work on because if that's not blended your eyeshadow is gonna come out patchy and you don't want that Alrighty, so we're gonna use the morphe 35b palette this is what it look like super pretty and like i said i'm gonna do blues so i'm gonna stick in only these shades i don't know if i'm gonna use all of them yeah but In this clip, I have a picture on the right side to show you guys the first color I'm using, which is just the light matte blue, and you'll just blend, blend, blend till your hand starts to get tired. And then in the next clip, I'll show you guys the darker blue that I'll use to use a smaller blending brush to blend them both in together. notice how like my hair is just not really laid don't say nothing pretend you don't see it because this is a struggle bun like real struggle bun try to do it for the first time by myself and if you know me you know i don't do, like doing my hair i'm just mad lazy you know it's like irritating and so I'm trying to do it by and I'm like I can do it watch like hundreds of tutorials you know I'm like hard could it, how hard could it be it's just a bun yeah like I wish you guys would have saw me because I was crying like <laughs> I was crying because I was mad and in pain like my arms have never been that type of sore ever and I just could not understand I was just like what's going on i'm sorry i'm just even myself is distracted by the background noise so story time over i guess and right here i'm just using a flat eyeshadow brush to pack on that third color on my lid So, it's not be my first time attempting um, a th uh, chunky eyeliner with glitter inside. Like, I've seen it so many times and it looks so pretty. You know what? I feel like there's not enough dimension in my eyes. So, I'm actually going to go in with... Uh, they don't have a color that I want. Like the Summer and the Anastasia palette. I think that'll look way better so i'm gonna use my finger and just tap in the center yeah okay okay <laughs> told y'all like i don't know what type of look this is gonna be but i just know that i wanted to do glue and uh glitter eyeliner I put that on the lid. Now we just go increase the intensity and then kind of fade it out. Yes. Okay, okay. 
Hello, blue blend. Yes. Good enough. Because I think I just want, I'm just more concerned about the eyeliner. You know. Yeah, I think that'll be so pretty. We're going to do that. Um, this glitter is by Hard Candy. Oh, no. Well, at least it's clear. They won't notice that it fell on the floor. And right here, I'm just doing the eyeliner. Just to make sure you make it thick enough so that there's actual space inside. I messed up a couple of times, but I mean... You won't notice after you put on the glitter and right here I'm just putting on the glue. Also, I'm sorry for the zoom in. It looks really weird in this clip, but hey, A for effort, right? <laughs> and now right here, I'm just putting on the loose glitter with the same detail brush that I applied with the glue. I'm surprised. It actually looks good. <laughs> so now I'm just gonna do my waterline area. Clean this up. Dang it. We almost there. Right here is the Sephora crayon pencil um, in the color My Boyfriend's Jeans. And right after, I'm gonna just go over that with the same color I used in my crease to just blend it out and tip which I'll be doing in three two one pinch it so that it can just be really small enough to smoke it out I'm too lazy to use my shader brush clearly and then I just clean up with the foundation brush because I hate how concealer looks And for my bottom lashes, I always use a second different mascara just because it'll help it look longer and fuller. And also in the next clip, I apply the underbrow bone color. I forgot to do that, so just blending it out, making it look matte and well blended with the blue. So I did my lashes off camera. <laughs> this is my first time wearing these. This is um, Lily lashes. The inside is still drying. But these are Lily lashes Miami. And they're actually really, really nice. Um, it feels so weird. Because, um, I, I don't know. I lied, because they're my only mink lashes, and I think it'll be my last, because I feel really bad. But they're not cute, like, bitch. I'm flying. <laughs> always use this. Chestnut by MAC. And I'm pretty sure I'm just going to do, like, a nude lip, because... I have a lot going on with the eyes right now, so.
You see? Oh, you can't see because you blinded, right? <laughs> Y'all see, like when you wet your um, brush, it makes a hell of a difference. See? And then I'm about to add right here. Bye. So effortless. A little for the chin chin chin. No, no. Some for the forehead. No, no. I don't even know why I just did my forehead because I have a big forehead already. So why am I trying to bring attention there? Don't know. But okay. Let me go look cute, cute. And I'll be back. My final look. What do you guys think? I'm actually like impressed. <laughs> you know when you just, you have an image in your head, but then when you do it don't really look the same so it's like yeah that's what happened but um not bad so we're gonna call this um winter wonderland makeup i think that name is stuck in my head because taylor made just like posted a bluish look and if you guys also do this please tag me i would love to see um, I hope this tutorial was really helpful and yeah, all the stuff that I used was pretty much affordable except the lashes. Let me know what you think, any comments, suggestions, but definitely like and subscribe so you can see my next video coming up. Um, I am going to be consistent, like I made this a go for my 2019, so we're going to do this, we're going to do this together, you know? Okay, I feel like I'm just talking too much. All right, so like, comment, subscribe. Thank you for watching.